Hello, welcome to Chess Prime. As part of this video, we are going to see how to install a Google Anti Gravity into Windows machine, right? So, before installing the Google Anti Gravity in Windows machine, I'm, let me give some more details about Anti Gravity. So, this Anti Gravity is a powered IDE which is built by Google DeepMind in November 2025. It's built on basically Visual Studio code to feel like all the developers are familiar with the IDE. So that's the reason it's built mainly on the a free version of Visual Studio code. It's available in Windows, Linux, Mac. Currently it's completely free and it's a it's in public preview mode. So it's a free we can use it. And as specific to internal, so this ID is built on top of the, the latest version of Gemini 3 Pro. And also it supports various models like Cloud, Sonnet 4.5, it's built by Anthropic. And other like open source models which is compatible with GPT OSS. It's a basically, it's an IDE, a powered IDE and which will work with multi-agent port inside it so that's a little brief introduction about this google anti-gravity ide so now let's get started that to download the anti-gravity first step so you can open this url antigravity.google and you can able to find the download icon over here you can click on the download and currently it's supporting the mac windows linux various operating system it's supporting so now as part of this video we are going to install into the windows machine so i am going to download a windows a 64 bit so let me download it you can click it and it started downloading it you can see over here once the download part is completed then you can come to download location and you can able to find the anti-gravity exe file over here the next is the installation part is very easy and very straightforward so let's get started so to install the anti-gravity in windows machine you can do the double click and then you will be getting this window so what you can do you can accept the agreements and go for next and by default it will try to install into the app data so go for it or else you can change the location and you can give the name the folder and Check for the desktop icon, whatever, if you are interested, or else go for the default, that should be absolutely fine. And go for the installation. So it will take a minute. So we can see now uh, the uh, development is almost completed we can see it's in finishing stage so now let's finish it and we can able to see the finally anti-gravity IDE so let me finish it so now what it will do it will try to open the anti-gravity IDE and we can see it is trying to coming up so let's give a couple of seconds so that it will come up completely of that we can able to see the uh, various options yes we can see so this is the anti-gravity complete ide we can see uh, we can see i mean we can upload the new projects similar like a visual studio code and if you want to see about this one you can see it's built on visual studio code right so that's the base version of this one and uh, it's anti-gravity and we can see another options over here the wizards it can change it for ide right so that's some of the options and like i said right so this is built by google and it's integrated with the uh, chrome so that you can able to verify your applications which is uh, built by this ide and it can able to validate with the help of a agents so that's one of the advantage it's come up with the inbuilt browser and we have to sign in to compatible with your browser so that's that's one of the things and currently we are in agent manager mode and we can see various icons so this is the way we can able to install into our machine and you can start using it so to start using it you can give the command and it will try to build the application we'll see 
that is one thing and we can see like i said it's currently it's using the latest model gemini 3 pro and it will support various models like i said um, a cloud desktop models which is related to 4.5 and it will use many other uh, gpt voices models as well right and uh, so we can see the uh, various agents like what agents you are trying to use the different conversion modes it's fast mode or planning so just go for the planning so that way we can see all the steps i think that's all about um, this anti-gravity tool installation steps if you like the video you can subscribe to the channel for more subsequent updates and thank you that's all about uh, this installation parts. If you like the video, you can subscribe to the channel for more subsequent updates and thank you.